I didn't realize how long it takes for men to come. I've been waiting and waiting. I've got some questions that I need to fire away <laughs> about love, life, dating and relationships. It's like chivalry is dead and the etiquette of dating doesn't exist anymore. I just need someone to show me how it's done to come here and come correct. We're finally here. Come correct, powered by Fireway Pizza. And yes, I'm back like I never left. Did you miss me? Favourite part? Do you want to smell you, it? No, I do not want to Do not get your dick out. I do not want to smell your dick. Do not tell me this is happening in real life, in real time. He's about to get his dick out. Done or young spray, Mr. RTM. The wire minister in the building, air to actually finally meet Cheyenne. I'm expecting her to be all over me, to be fair, like bare questions, bare mind games, you get me? But I'm here on mind games, so I'm ready for her still. I'm just going to give her what she wants to hear, basically. Over looking forward to this date, mate. I need to get her in my ass. Hello. <laughs> No, what time do you call this, babe? I know, sorry. Yeah. Not me being late to my own show. Okay, <laughs> mad. I thought I was, you know what I mean? I thought I was taking love. I know, I you some flowers. Thank you, it's a plant. From downstairs, I know, man. I was going to get you some flowers, but... It's the thought that counts. I had to get some weed again. But yeah, well, go on. Yeah, how's Cheyenne? Hey, I'm Spray. Nice to meet you. Young Spray. Young Spray? Yeah. Good. Yeah. You look nice. You look nice. What is he wearing? You look nice. I've been waiting for this date. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. You hot? Are you making me hot? Yeah. <laughs> You're making me hot still. Charmer, yeah? Yeah. Am I making him hot? Ready? Do you like guys with long hair? I like your hair. You sure? Yeah. I weren't sure about it. Why? You look nice. I don't know. Man. Yeah. Normally I have a fade, innit? But yeah, well, go and say it. Yeah. Well, nice, go on. nice to meet you. Like, obviously, I, I see you online. Yeah. Yeah. It's nice actually. Everyone to sees you. me online. Yeah, like that. Yeah. Wait, sorry. You look nice. You dress nice. Sorry, I was gonna do. How many layers? No, I was gonna do a little burglary. No, I'm joking. Are you alright? No, 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 I'm joking. I'm joking. Come on, if I was doing a burglary, I'd have the full gloves. Yeah. <laughs> You right, Cole? Yeah, well, it's nice to meet you. And you? Officially. Ooh. Officially. So, tell me a bit about yourself. Why do they call you Young Spray? Well, basically, when I was younger, I used to like to spray things. Just, what, graffiti? Guns. Like, real life guns. Shit Look, people. I don't date no more. Allegedly. Listen, I told her I'm a maniac. She don't believe me. You get me? But ask the streets. They know what I've got. Really? Allegedly. Is that a problem? Well, it's a bit mad. It's taken me back a bit. Oh, no, yeah. no, seriously. So you used to... What, what age was this? Oh, no, no. Um, when I was younger, people used to say that. But oh, you're just mad. Like... Crazy, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I've changed, I've changed. I've turned over a new leaf. That's good. Done all my prison and... All yeah? That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you've done prison? Oh, another one that's been to prison. Yeah, I just do a podcast now, RTM podcast, free the guys. Yeah? So, yeah, free the guys. What's RTM mean? Realer the most. Realer the most. Are yeah. you real? Huh? Are you real? Realer the most. Yeah? Yeah, yeah 100%. The realest? 100%. Realer the most. Okay. Not the realest, realer the most. Re yeah, but are you the realest? No, I'm realer the most. That's what I'm saying, RTM. I can't call the realist guy. I ain't met everyone on earth. Oh, but I'm humble. really the most. No, I'm not humble. I'm really yeah, the most. Yeah, it's being humble, saying oh, you're not the realist. Yeah, I'm not, but I don't know everyone. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I've lost okay. a few fights as well. Have you? One more than I've lost. That's right. I'm a lover, not a fighter. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> I love hard. <laughs> I do. Yeah, I'm a proper, like... I'm hard. Huh? I'm hard. You're hard. Ooh. What, bad man? My willy. Man's, man's hard still. Man's hard still, the things. Really? Yeah. Right now? Right now, you want to feel it? I know, no, okay, I do man. not okay, want right. to feel it. Yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> Did he just, am I hearing right? Did he just say he was hard? Um, so tell me a bit more about yourself. Well, basically, I do a podcast, RTM podcast. Um, 
every week, me and my co-host, um, Queen Ice Cream. Um, I was born in Dominica. That's why I got this hat, repping my hat. Um, and came here when I was seven, nearly seven. And like, yeah. Yeah? That's about it. Like, I do. Mu I used to do music. Sorry, shit. I used to be a rapper. Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. I'm getting mad. I, I used to be a rapper. More like music. I used to be a rapper. But even, you get know what I'm saying? I've been on a few dates this year. I'm not going to lie to you. Boy, I've been on one date. This Furthermore, it's 2024. I've been on no dates this year. Zero dates this year, but the last one of last year was that me show. Um, but yeah, I thought I was coming to see Cheyenne. So yeah, this is my first proper date. You yeah. Know, the first light brick that I've sat down with. The first what? <laughs> light brick. Light brick. Brick? Yeah, light What's... brick. Mixed what? race. Oh, I've never heard of that. Yeah, light brick. Like, you know, yellow brick road? Yeah. Yeah, yellow brick road, light brick. I've never heard of that. Yeah, you're yeah, light brick. I like light bricks. Okay, I've never heard of that. I like black girls as well, but you know, like, Sometimes they're a bit too, you know what I'm saying? No, they're not. Uh, some of them. No, they're not. Take, some. I guess it's your it's your experience, so I can't tell you it's Yeah, not. yeah, they take too long to have sex. What do you mean they take too long to have too sex? Too many dates before sex. So what, are you saying mixed race girls are loose? Not loose, but it's quicker sex. No. No, we don't. Like, we definitely don't. Listen, I didn't say light-skinned girls give quick sex. I said light-skinned girls give quicker sex. Normally. Well, it's not going to be like that with us. Allegedly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Allegedly, you get what I'm saying? I'm still hopeful. Hopeful, yeah. Hopeful. We like that. I'm... No, he's funny. No, he's, he's quite funny, you know? Hopeful. Be hopeful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, so, well, I interview different people and, um, yeah. Yeah. How long have you been doing that? Um, three years beforehand, obviously, I was a rapper. You get what I'm saying? I'm one of the pioneers, but... I didn't make the top 50 in the complex list because obviously they're dickheads. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or is it just because you're just not doing it anymore? Politics, no, politics. You get what I'm saying? They just, because I dissed one of their, um, one of the people that um, was on the, you know, like the what panel. Oh, oh. Yeah, 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 one hippo. She was on the panel. One hippo? Yeah, I what dissed do you mean? her. I dissed her. Hippopotamus. So you're calling the woman a hippo? Hippo. But this is why you're not in there because. No, 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 no. But it should be based on that. Of, obviously, it should, it should be based be, on the. Do you get what I'm saying? Come on, man. But you know what I mean. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah. The hippo. You can't call women hippopotamuses, though. I didn't call her that. I just said she resembles one. So you're calling her mm. a hippopotamus. Yeah. That's not nice, is it? No, it's not nice. Don't even try it. Not here for the woman slander. <laughs> Trust me, she was a hippopotamus. Hippo. No. Would you say you're a gentleman? I'm a gangster and a gentleman. Is it? The balance? Mm. So, you're from Dominica? Yes, Dominica, not the Republic. Not the Republic, this is Dominica. A lot of people get it mixed up because they say like Dominican Republic or they say, are you Dominican? I say, no, I'm not Dominican, I'm Dominican. Dominican. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. It's nice. Dominica is Dominica, the most natural island in the Caribbean. Dominican Republic is Dominican Republic. They do voodoo. Where are you from? Where's your parents from? My family are St. Lucian, um, Jamaican and English. You feel St. Lucia? Who's from St. Lucia? Well, both my parents mixed race, actually. Both of them? Yeah, both. I thought one was black and one was white. No, yeah, both my parents mixed race. Oh, don't lie. A light brick couple yeah. from, from St. Lucia. Jamaica. You know about Sakafet? I didn't, do you know I'm like the most uncultured? Ah, oh, you're more person. Tommy Robinson than Nils Stop Nelson. Stop it! Mandela. You're more Tommy than Nelson. I'm definitely not Tommy. No, let's, don't even try do this whole Tommy Nelson thing. Listen, she's definitely on Tommy's side, but I'm trying to bring her over to the Nelson Mandela side. Don't do that. No, I'm saying, because obviously you've got lightweight people, and some of them, I mean, they're either on the black side yeah. or they're on the white side. Which side are you on? Are, no, you on are you on Tommy Robinson's side or the Nelson Mandela side? No, do you know what it is? Is for me, I was, well, I was raised in a predominantly white area, mm. but... Tommy Robinson's side. But I definitely, like, as I got older, was more in tune with, because my dad lived in South, innit? So mm. I was more, I moved in with my dad and I just found it a lot better, if that makes sense, because mm. it was just really hard living in a world that is so... Did you grow up on white boys? Did I grow up? Yeah, on white boys. Yeah. So you used to deal with bare white boys? And now you're dealing with big black cock? Don't. But yes. 
Black and ill. Yes, I do date black men. Are you okay Obviously. with Are you okay with NBC? What's NBC? Medium black cop. Me, yeah, I guess so. Are I you don't okay discriminate. With... Cause, okay, cool. Yeah. I've got a magic trick. Oh, is it? What's that? It's a dickhead willy when it's soft, but then when it's hard, it's, it does its job. Oh, is it? It's capable. It's capable, as long as it does the job. Okay, you've got tight pom pom. Yeah. Ah, oh, he's so vulgar. Yeah, it's actually no complaints. I'm not even gonna lie. She's giving off that tight energy. With girls, like, um, the pom pom's got a smile, correct? Yeah. That's a big deal for me. Um, have you ever had BV? The BV is a thing a lot of women get it. So don't even... Don't so have even, you had BV? All women have had it or experienced it at some point in their life. Don't even try it. Fuck it all, mate. BV, bong in vagina. She's just sat there and told me she's had bong in vagina. Fuck that, I'm out. Have you got BV now? No, I have not got BV now. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Firstly, listen, if you're a gentleman and a gangster, you're not going to come for me about... A, I'm going to come for you. No, I'm definitely going to come for you. A woman's health issue... Babe, I'm going to come. We're both going to come. I'm telling you, a mm. woman's health issue, you can't... I don't stop unless you come. You... Well, that's good to know. Mm. He's mad. Like, he's actually mad. <laughs> no, seriously. But with, with women, like women's health and stuff, you can't sit and, like, rule, rule a situation out because I'm sure guys have a smelly dick. Every now and then, or, and whatever it's called, have you know. You, have you, have you There's something everyone's dealt with someone that smelt before, and at the end of the day, it's kind of like we're grown adults, so it's not going to sit and bring someone down about it. It would just be like, babe. I put aftershave on my. On no, my but that's, well, that would make it smell. When I. That's right, what aftershave. Make it smell. It does. Because, yeah, no, because it's a chemical. I put everything. Yeah, but don't do that. Just water. Am I hearing that correct? He's spraying his penis. Makes sense, young spray. Like, in general, with your body, yeah, nah, with your myself. private parts... Do you want to smell you, it? No, I do not want to... Do not get your dick out. I do not want to smell your dick. Do not tell me this is happening in real life, in real time. He's about to get his dick out. Oh, uh, it's a dickhead, really. I wouldn't have got it out a yet. dickhead? What do you mean? I wouldn't have got it out yet. It needs to rise first. It needs to rise. Yeah, it went... It was risen a minute ago. Went, and then as soon as you asked down. me about smelly vaginas... It went back down. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's not... We're, we're not going to go there about women. I'll take my... Oh, you're actually... A lot more handsome without the glasses. Oh, do you know what it is? Because my eyes go mad sometimes. So what do you mean? That they get big and. Oh, is it? Yeah. Looks way better without the glasses. It's actually very handsome. Can I try your glasses on? Yeah, you can. Yeah, so what do you like to do for fun? Um, For fun, I like to fuck. You like to fuck for fun? Yeah. Do you have a lot of fun then? They suit me. No, they do, they do. But, um, no, on a level, I like to. Hmm, what do I like to do for fun? My podcast is quite fun for me. Yeah. And um Oh fuck for real. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll get mad. I was trying to I'll get mad. I was trying to act a bit sweeter. Oh really? Yeah, I like you a bit. I like you a bit. I'm gonna lie, you know. Listen, I like to have sex for fun, innit? What? Ain't sex fun? Oh is it? Little, you like me? A little bit. A little bit. So you're out here. Do you know what it is? No, no, no. Last I went on a date um a couple of weeks ago. And I thought it was you. Oh, really? Yeah, I thought it was you. thought it was me? Yeah. But it wasn't. They chipped me, Harry. Stand oh, up. Yeah. They chipped me. Oh, that's a shame. We're here now. They chipped me, you get me, so. But I came, I bought, I bought Gucci, I bought everything. Oh, is you. it? Yeah. But I like this hat, so it's all right. Yeah, I couldn't do Gucci this time. So, just done Zara. Yeah, it's nice. I think you look nice. You actually you know what is? really well. I'll be honest with you. I was going to go to the Gucci again, yeah? But what happened? I went Gucci the last time when I thought it was you, and they told me my Gucci was from Turkey. Oh. So if I'm not going to waste my money this it was time, Gucci. I'm going to go Zara. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Big up Zara. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> so, what would you say is the hardest challenge you've faced in your life? Prison, probably. Is it? it? Wasn't really a challenge, but I don't know. That's just you throw me off there. Yeah. But what what was that like for you? Was it? That's what I'm saying. I'm thinking I've said the wrong thing already. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm it's your life. It's... No, but that's what I'm saying. You just asked me something. What's I don't know. Mm. I don't know what challenges I've had in my life. What's the hardest? I've had bare hard. Oh, hardest challenge. Losing my mum. That's a challenge. Yeah. Yeah, that's a I'm challenge. I'm really sorry to hear that. Yeah, that's a challenge, isn't it? Oh, my God. Yeah, did a... that right? No, that's... Answer or not. No, I don't you... know. No, and how, how did you deal with that? Because grief is like... 
really taken it's like people don't especially men mm. especially black men they don't express what grief is like for them or a loss especially yeah. being your mother I was really close to my mum. Come on, man. I'm a favourite. You get me? Her birthday's three days after mine. You get me? R.I.P. the quid. How did you deal with that? I just got on with it. You just got on with it? Yeah. Just tried to stay busy. Stay busy? Yeah. Have you ever, like, what's your, have you ever, like, had therapy or anything? No. Would you ever? No. What's your thoughts on therapy? I don't, um, obviously I've got nothing against yeah. therapy for people that, um, that's what they're into. Oh, that's what they need. But me, personally, I've got a problem with talking to strangers about Stop. my life. Yeah, yeah. You reckon? Yeah. Men, if you're listening, please go to therapy. Have you ever tried, though? No. No. It might be good, though, but I bet you but I've got, fine, though. You like... know, that's what I'm saying. I've got my sister. I've got, um, I've got a couple mates yeah. that they're good therapists. Yeah, good. Yeah. I, think, I think everyone needs, especially guys, a strong female figure in your life, especially if it's the loss of your mum, so I'm really sorry mm. about that for you. It's alright. Um, are you going to be the strong woman that I need? I could be. Joking. I could be for you. Joking. But you got to build to get there. I'm building right now. Yeah? yeah? Do you think I could be the strong woman for you that you need? I think so. You think so? Do you think so? I reckon I could. We'll see. We'll see how the on. date goes. Oh, Willie Hard, Willie Hard. <laughs> yeah. Willie Hard, you get me Willie Hard. <laughs> Willie back hard, go on. Boy, I don't know if she could be a strong woman for me, but I could definitely be a strong man for her. What, because I said I'd be a strong woman for you? Strong. I'll be a strong man for you. Strong. Yeah, I like that. Strong man <laughs> for you. You get me? Obviously, I ain't been gym for a bit. What? You're looking all right. Well done. And I've got the little E that... <laughs> I've got the little E that thing, you get me? I've got to make the E that thing show, you get me? No, but I'm not materialistic, though. Huh? I'm not materialistic, I didn't though. say you was. I'm just saying, I'm not going to know. It's no, a it's real nice, one. Though. It's, it's a... not a fake one, because everyone, they're rocking a the fake one. This is a real one. No, it's Obviously, nice. Like, yeah. At first, I thought the outfit was a bit mad, but since he's taken all the accessories off, it, the outfit works. It looks nice. So, I think you're put together really well. Do you reckon? Yeah. I think you're put together very well, mate. Thank well, you. Actually, that was a bit of that. <laughs> you're funny. That was a bit of that, mate. A bit of that. Can know. you get a bit of that, though? Huh? Not with that attitude. Do you reckon? No, I feel like you've got, you know... Because I'm wicked. Do I think I could get a bit of that? Yeah. I think you're nice. <laughs> you know, I feel like you've got like, the, when you do this, do you like your intrusive thoughts? Mm. It's like, gives me like, do you like that dirty dog energy where you're like. Dirty naughty. dog? Yeah, like naughty. Dirty dog? Yeah. Calling me a dirty dog. Like when you do your intrusive things, it's like, look, just calm down. The fact that his intrusive thoughts are coming out loud, that is dirty dog energy. What do you mean? Like you're composed really well, like you're really well, and then sometimes yeah. your mouth just lets you down. Yeah. Mm. It's funny though, but that's why I shouldn't entertain it, because it is funny. Mm. <laughs> I'm fucking getting mad, mate. My shoes getting madder. Um, what advice would you give to young men, especially on grief? On grief? Yeah. Man up. What? Just man up. No, but I feel like mental health is such a... You like, just ask me a question, that's my answer, man. It up. is just man up. Yeah, man up. Do you not, men. Yeah, but do you not think that you're creating... Like, I feel like with your thought process and that mindset, it creates this pressure for men to, like, get overwhelmed and frustrated. And it's like, why a lot, the male suicide rate is a lot higher than women's. So do you stop think killing yourself. Yeah, but you can't just say stop killing yourself. Why are they killing yourself for? Because of the pressures with the mindset like yours. Man up. Just man up. Yeah, man up. What did you do to man up then? Manned up. You buy it. What did you do? Did you go gym? Did you work um, out? Did you write letters to yourself? It's like, hard. At, it's hard at the start, but at, by the end of it, you realise you're a man. <laughs> yeah. You man up. Listen, the way you man up is to fucking man up. Be a fucking man, mate. You know what I mean? Yeah, but how? Like, I'm trying to go. I don't the... know. What do you mean how? I like, don't know. What, what, what do you did mean? you do? So when you was going through a hard time, you just go. Uh, what did you do? Smoke like, weed. I smoke weed and a lot of beer weed. More weed than snoop. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's but, a good um, way to ease the pain. It is, but not yeah. not not for too long. Forever. What? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I, I, I quit smoking last year for about eight months, and then I tried to quit smoking this year, but it lasted about twelve hours. Oh, was it? Yeah. Now I've quit trying to quit. I I don't know if it's because I'm anti-smoker, but smoking is not the answer. It's like yeah, but sometimes people have their vices, so I'm guessing smoking's yours. Yeah, smoke. Thing. Do you yeah. find that you have and a... no condoms? What do you mean? Is it out? 
their back in? No condoms. Is that advice? What, are you just having sex? I'm not just out there going mad, but I'm saying when I do, it's no condoms. Okay. So. Thank you for that useless bit of information. Do you use condoms? Well, if I'm with someone. Do you use condoms? No, if I'm with someone. That's what I'm saying. Partner. What's the point? That girl doesn't use any condoms, yeah? That's beer back, yeah? You do it in the beginning until you trust them. No. I pray to God at the beginning. Stop it. I have to, because I have to trust you. So I have to pray to risk. God. No, but I have yeah, to I trust you. Do you get what I'm saying? I have to trust that. you because I don't know, innit? So I've got to trust you the first time, but I don't want condoms. Really? No. Risky. I hear it though. Spray. Praying is not a form of contraception. Wrap it up. No, condoms, you don't feel the proper thing, innit? You don't feel the goodness. The, the goodness. Yeah, you don't feel how wet it is. <laughs> Fuck condoms, mate. You can't even feel the fucking pom pom, mate. You can't even feel the panache. And it stinks. What, the rubber? Don't you think condoms stink? Yeah, it smells like the rubber, innit? Yeah, it stinks. It's like the friction. But when the wire for that, I was going to say when the cum's in it, but. Yeah. Where, I'm the wire minister. I can't even go too mad. I can't go too mad. I can't even believe that was coming yeah. out of my mouth. Coming out of my mouth is a wire as well. Yeah. yeah, I'm going mad. Calm down, I'm going mad. Isn't it? Yeah. You're a bit of a madman, isn't it? Mm. You're definitely a mad girl. Do you think? 100%. What makes me mad? That you're half black and half white. Mm. All mixed race people are crazy. I've got a mixed race brother and sister. Oh, is it? Yeah, so I know first hand mixed race people are mental. Yeah, we are a bit. Yeah, definitely. But, but I feel like it's like controls, though. Chicken. Yeah, because you like, there's been times I've been completely unhinged. Mm. Like, on an embarrassing level. Mm. But I think now, as I've got older, I can understand, like, where I'm at. Mixed race people are fucking lunatics. Trust me, I've got a mixed race brother and a mixed race sister, and they're both fucking nuts. Have you ever been with a black boy? Yeah. A proper black boy, not like What's a mixed a race. black boy? Not a mixed race, like a black boy. I'm like I'm a black boy, black mum, black dad, black boy. Have you been with a black boy? Are you right? Have you been you're with a black boy? You're not talking to an idiot. No, but I'm saying, have you been with a black boy? Yes, I have. A proper one? Yeah. Oh, she ain't been with a proper black guy, man. She's been with some black chief. What's a proper one? Would you say you're a proper one? Proper black boy, mate. Proper black boy. Dominica, mate. Is it? Yeah, mate. Black mum, black dad. Proper black boy, mate. Yeah? Yeah, mate. Proper Yeah, mate. mate. So you've gone from this to now Giza. So... Switch it up. Bang is it. there not black people in East London? <laughs> Is there not black people in East London and Pyre Mash? Because I'm from East London. Oh, is it? Yeah, East, North, East, North East. North East. North Star, Tottenham. Everywhere. Everywhere. Okay. I, mean, yeah. I want to know a bit more about your upbringing. Do you? Yeah. What about it? Yeah, I want to know, like, so you've been to prison, so before that, like, That's your lifestyle. That's not my upbringing. <laughs> no, but I mean, as in your You're going lifestyle. mad, you're thinking my mum banged me up to go to prison. No, I mean, as in, I want to know, like, if you've been to prison, mm. so I want to know. What led you there? Crime. Makes sense. Crime. Yeah, crime. Why? Lots of crime. Why crime? Why did you? What? What? At what point in your life did you choose crime? Uh, 14, Fourteen. Thirteen. Fourteen. Really? Yeah. So, what was your upbringing like? Running away from. Was you just an asbo? No, I think asbo is a um, funny because it's asbo means antisocial. Antisocial. I was yeah. extremely social. Do you know what I mean? And I think a lot of people that they give the ASBO stuff to, they're actually extremely social as well. Very we're social. A bit too we're, social. We're outside, you get me? So, yeah, I was very social. Very, very social. Yeah. And then what, what was it? Just kind of like, was you grabbed by lifestyle when it comes to wanting to seek this life of crime? I don't know. I just looked up. Maybe I looked up to the wrong people. I don't yeah. Know. I think that's what I mean. It's more like in those situations when you're around like certain influences that's why i wanted to know like would you say you were easily influenced sure Someone's playing my... easy influence no maybe so have you got um my phone sorry you... that's all right what do you need my phone i don't know where my phone did we put it on charge or not is he actually getting his phone out am i that boring what was he saying so tell me about your upbringing my mom she had five kids I was the youngest, um, yeah, 
grew up in. On a five? Yeah, yeah, I was the youngest, so it's probably her favourite. You get me? Oh, is it? Yeah, me and her first, actually. Me and, yeah, so. That's cute. Yeah, my eldest brother. He's the one that made me comb my hair. Yeah, that's nice. Because my last date, obviously, he was just chatting shit. He was like, oh, why didn't you cut your hair? Because oh. he followed me after, innit? Because he went a bit viral, innit? Okay. Standout thing. You get me that mean short girl. Obviously, Cheyenne, you're the proper girl. You get me so. No, we're, we're both doing our thing. No, I rate her. I rate her. I rate you. But you've come to see me now. I'm coming tonight. You're not coming tonight, but you've come here. I'm coming tonight. You come here. Babe, I'm coming tonight. I'm coming tonight. 100% I'm coming. 100%. Tonight. Does he actually think he's coming back home with me tonight? 100%. You're coming where? My willy. I'm going to ban you from. Mm. Talking about your dick, just so you know. No, no, no I, I watch porn. Do you watch porn? No, I don't. What, you what don't you watch, watch porn? No. She fucking definitely watches porn. She probably watches all that lesbian shit, doing the scissors and all that bullshit. You don't watch no porn. You've never watched I porn used before. To. So why did you stop? I grew up. But I'm older than you and I still watch porn. Yeah, it'll be a pan in Neverland. What makes you think that? There's an age limit to watch. There's not. Porn. I've not watched porn in like a good 10 years. Okay, I'm exaggerating a little, but I've not watched porn in a while. <laughs> There's not an age limit, but I just think one... That's weird. No, it's not. I think... You it's... think you grow out of watching porn? Of course you do. How do you it's grow like... out of watching porn? Because for me, my imagination is good. Um... Yeah, imagination. I, I... No, but I think as well, it's kind of like... What the fuck? Porn is the best thing in the world for a man like me, because I'm too busy. Do you know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? If you're a busy guy, there's nothing like coming home as long as it's after 9.30 because I've got the fucking, I've got the kids thing on, innit? The 9.30 thing. So, yeah. As long as it's after 9.30, nothing wrong with having a wank. For me, I experienced a point, like, I had this epiphany in the sense of I didn't like what porn was doing. I feel like it's really bad. I think it's, but it depends what you're looking up. You're a bit too emotional, I think. No, it is because it's like porn, it desensitises what real emotion and what real Maybe exists. it's different between girls and boys, isn't it? Yeah, because you've got... What kind of porn do you watch? No, that's what I'm... It's not lesbian porn. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying, though, but Probably, it's... like, I watch mad... Um, you know, they slap her. This is what I'm saying. They slap the girl. Yeah, I'm not... It's, and then they saying. choke her. But, but this is what I'm saying. It gives an unrealistic expectation. How's that unrealistic? I've slapped girls before doing sex and choked Yeah, them. some girls like it. Like, they like, they like love the it. Choke. They we don't like love the choke. It. We don't they love it. That's what I'm saying. They love it. I swear down. Yeah, but not all the time. Yeah, but sometimes I just like love. I like passion. Mm. I yeah, like... but that's... You know what I mean? Obviously, yeah. we get best of both worlds. Yeah, balance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. balance. Around balance. You start with the slaps and then you but end you with the You don't start with the slaps. You start soft. Then you do a few slaps, and then, then you end soft, soft again. Exactly. Pardon me, pardon me. So <laughs> you can work still when you get... Yeah, 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 for real, for real. You start with a slow grind, for real. Exactly. Yeah, slow grind, yeah. go mad, <laughs> and then slow grind again, for real. You know the thing. You know the thing, you know the thing, you know the thing still, you know the thing. You can't go too crazy all the way. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Ooh. Exactly. When was the last time you had six? Couldn't tell you that. No? Mm -mm. Why not? No, it was recent. It was recent? Yeah. So, what are we doing here? But, well, it's <laughs> not What are we doing here? <laughs> what are we doing here? What are we doing here? No, but I'm being honest, it was recent. I know, but what are we doing here then? So, why is, he, he, why is he not there? What, what happened? Because it finished. Huh? How recent? That's Do you know what, what it is? <laughs> That's crazy. I'm just being honest. It was recent. Ish. It's really hard. <laughs> mind games. <laughs> mind games still recent. It has been it's recent. Mind games. Yeah, but my recent. recent. Well, she said she last had sex recently. I think she had sex yesterday. No, but my recent could be very different to your recent. Like my recent is like the other month. It's recent still. Exactly, but your recent might have been yesterday. No, that's recent. What's your still. recent? When that's was recent. your last time? That's recent still. So what was yours yesterday? No, I said yours is recent. Yeah, when was yours? Mine definitely wasn't. Yeah, mine is way before yours. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, that's what oh. I'm saying. I've been, yeah, yeah. Babe, I'm the one talking about porn, obviously. You clearly don't need it. Yeah, exactly. You clearly don't need porn. And clearly you do. I needed it. Do you get oh. what I'm saying? Need a helping hand. But it was probably a white boy anyway, so it's mental. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? What's wrong with white boys? Nah, man. I got bare white bridges. You get me? But obviously, once you go black, you don't go back, so they say. Yeah, apparently. Yeah, but you went back. <laughs> so it's mad. Might be mad. 
What's wrong with white boys? Have you got tight pom pom? Why do you keep asking about my pussy? If you're gonna keep talking and asking about my vagina, just know all this chat is drying it up. Isn't that the first time I, I asked about it? No, it's not the first time. It's a big deal for me though. Why is it a big deal for you? What kind of women do you sleep with for it to be a big deal? Because what? I don't sleep with no one. You don't sleep with no one? No. Virgin? No, I'm not a virgin, but I don't sleep, exactly. with, I don't sleep around. You don't sleep around? No, no. That's good. Only relationship. Really? Because I always used to, Joe, I used to be very immature. Mm. And I used to think, oh, like, because I think all oh, vaginas are tight because they, even after childbirth, like, they shrink back. Like, that's just how they are because it's like a muscle, isn't it? Mm. And you could do, like, there's, like, muscle exercises that you can do. I don't think every, all the girls want yeah, to shrink can make, back. No but, you, no, but you can make yourself tighter. You do these exercises. Mm. Like, I'm do doing them? it right now. Like, I'm literally doing it right now. Fucking doing well. I had her doing fucking pom pom exercises. Is that because you like me? <laughs> no, I'm just saying. Like, I'm saying is that you, you like. Is no, that, I'm just saying. Because you're playing, you're, you're doing madness no, with your pom pom. No, right but now. I was just using that as an you're example. You're doing it right now, though. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Hey. <laughs> no, hey. That's enough for me. That's enough. For no, but me. you're doing it right now. That's I enough for me. Doing that as an example. That's enough for me. You're doing it right now. So we're on the right page. No, but I'm saying, I'm saying as women. You can We're doing do it. Right do you're doing course. it now. You're doing it now. That's the car. I'm doing everything now as well. You get me? Calm yourself down. All right, cool. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I think you could be dominated, you know. Do you reckon? Mm -hmm. How? You could get in the bedroom. You could definitely be put in your place. <laughs> Don't wire me up. I think you're good. And I'm talking about slapping and yeah. being madness. Definitely. You're thinking I could be dominated by who? Me. You. How are you going to dominate me? How are you going to dominate me? I definitely me? could. Don't, don't worry. You don't think I could? And 100% not. Definitely no, not. Did... Definitely not. Look at me, straight in my face. You could never dominate me. Never. Fucking dominate me. She could never fucking dominate me. Unless I wanted her to. <laughs> Why are you laughing at you saying life? it? Because I'm laughing at your... That's too crazy. I can't believe you're thinking you can dominate me. I definitely could. I don't think so. You don't? No, I don't think so. Don't think so. I think you could try it. Ah, oh, God loves a triumph. Yeah, yeah, I think you could try and <laughs> not at all. Listen, I can definitely dominate him. I'm telling you now. No, but are you no, always no. like this? Mm -hmm. Always like what? A bit unhinged. What do you mean? Like... ADHD? What, what yeah. do you mean? I don't know what do you mean. Know, like, I'm husband. just myself. What are you talking would you, about? Would you say you're... Are you always like this? Yeah. So, yeah. What are you talking about? Like, you're very... Very what? High part and then, like, low. What do you mean? I don't know. I'm myself. Yeah, like ADHD. Is that mad? Do you have actual ADHD? Is that mad? I don't know. I don't care. Is that mad though? Am I acting mad? No, it's it's nice. Huh? It's nice. It's you. You sure? Yeah. All right, cool. Is this an air cut? Cool. Or should I put the hat back on? No, I like the hair. It's a bit of a mad one. I think it's really nice. But I'm growing it. You get yeah. Me? For a sip. Are you gonna get dreads? I weren't sure. That's think... what I'm saying. I don't know. But what it is, obviously, because bare people go old and I mean go bald and that. I'm just trying to show that if we've got to... hair, you're on flex. Listen. If we used to have kids, they'd have nice hair. Because you got nice hair, I got nice hair. They'll have yeah. nice hair. So I did see your interview. Why is it an issue for women to have kids? Because the, you saw the interview, so you saw my answer to it. Yeah, but I why? Don't, is... Why do I need to be around no, or care about no baby father? Why is it an issue if a woman has kids? Let's be real. It's twenty twenty four now. Yeah, but have, you've you've got. A yes, son, right? you saw the interview. Yes, I've got a son. Yeah, but do you not think that makes you a hypocrite? No, men are different. Men are different to women. Women are women, men are men. Men have dicks, women have pussy. Yeah. They're different. We have we play different roles. Yeah, but I think it's. Do you get what I'm trying to I say? Think it's like different to what you want. Then. You can't. You can't call. No, women are not to act like men. That's how I. That's how I feel. That's my. Do you know what I mean? Men can get away with a lot more sexually if I say like not like that. But that's your garden. You're supposed to protect your garden. We come in the garden. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. The garden gets come in the garden. Come in the garden? Access denied in this one. This don't get coming. <laughs> you get what I'm yeah. saying? Unless you're a batty boy. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? But <laughs> the proper heterosexual, there's no come, nothing. You get what I'm saying? So I'm getting mad a bit. But yeah, <laughs> that was a bit mad. Yeah, no, but I just feel like it's like you're a grown man. Mm. I feel like you have to get to a point where you have to accept that most likely at the age that we are, that you're going to entertain someone that has got kids. Mm. But what it is now, yeah, at the age we are, you've got a choice. 
you get what I'm saying? You watch my interview and it's like, there's girls out here that ain't got kids. Like yeah. Kelly Lara, like Ashley from Big Brother. They ain't got kids. They're like past 40. So I'm sure they're not the only two. Fuck looking after kids that's, that ain't mine. Fuck that. The oh, fuck? Do you know how much money I spent on my kid? Yeah, there's definitely women. There's women kids. with no kids. Do you get what yeah. I'm saying? If you want to hold out for women, like I said, you saw the interview, it's got to be a proper love bug. Yeah. No, it has, listen, to, there's it has no... to be a proper love bug and it can't be two kids. Yeah, yeah. but I think if you fall in love, mm. you, you can't prevent whether they've got kids or not. Have you been in love? Like, in of course I've been in love. love. Of course I've been in deep love. Like, I'll come out from a 15-year relationship. I'm here to fucking make my baby mother jealous. Well, we're not off to a good start, are we? Why? Does he even like me? Has he only come here to make his baby mum jealous? Is this what men are doing now? Because why would you want to make her jealous? Because she dumped me. Yeah, that, that's literally, I swear to God, it's like this revenge mm. flex that men do, isn't it? It's not a revenge flex. Why do men do it? Why don't why women do well, revenge women do flex? It, exactly, do it. why does it have to be men? Yeah, but I'm just saying, you're here doing it. I'm, I'm on my second date here, because I know the last date I went on, she acted like she ain't watched it. I know she watched it, but she acted like she ain't watched it. She could see the Michelle girl, whatever, I'm acting mad or whatever, but the Michelle girl, she was smelling mad still, you get me? Come on. I know she's acting like she didn't, she weren't, but... <laughs> Is it? 100%. You get, Confident. come on, baby, come on, we're here. Oh, my baby, baby treatment. Baby girl, listen. Oh, baby girl. Baby girl, listen, we're here. Even with the afro, I'm doing all right. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Baby mother needs to know herself. Do herself. Yeah, man. Trying to make my baby mother jealous. You get me? Cause she go on like, is it me? Like she don't respect the thing, is it me? So she have to see that it's me a Chris girl. I'm looking, is it me? Yeah, but you can't make her jealous though. I'm not, she, I'm not trying to, Like I if, am, if she happens I'm... to be jealous, mm. then yeah. But I feel like when you go to be intentionally jealous, mm. that says more about you than it does about anything else. I don't care. That's why then. Mm. Why do you not care? Because why should I care? Because it's the mother of your child? Yeah, no, no, no. That's what I'm saying. I care about her, but I'm saying I don't care if she's jealous or not because we're not together. Oh, is it? Mm. Not together? No. Would not you together. ever get back with her? Because I feel like, mm. and can you answer this? I know you can't speak for all men, but when would you go back and sleep with... Uh, when what? <laughs> Would you go back and sleep with your baby mums? Because I know it's a thing, like... Would I go back and sleep with my baby mother? <laughs> How do you know I'm not sleeping with her now? This is why I have an issue with it, because I feel like all mm. people say, like, you know, and it's like, oh, dropping off the kids and... Would you have a threesome with me and my baby mother? No. Would Are you, you right? No, I'm saying, would you... Have you ever slept with any girls? No. Tell the truth. Um, next question. Do you never slept with a girl? Have you sat fanning before? Have you? Once you saw my interview. Yeah, but I'm asking you. I like to yeah, but you saw my interview. So I said once, did it? And I felt like a pussy. Just one time. Yeah, I felt like a pussy. You are what you eat. You are what you eat. Mm. I felt like a fucking it's pussy. Good for you. It's not good for me. Yeah, protein. Mm. Have you sat pussy? I might have. I might not have. I don't know. What does this mean? I'm not sure. So yeah. You, you, you suck my you baby mum's pussy. Why does he keep talking about another woman? We are on a date. Why? Do you want to just bring bring your baby mum? Because <laughs> I feel like joking. you keep bringing her up. She might as well just come and pull up a chair. Yeah? We'll just do a nice polyamorous nah, relationship. You got me you got me there like you suck pussy, don't worry. Alright, cool, we're in the game. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> we're in the game, we're heavy. Listen, we're not mm. plot, plotting a little three-way polyamorous relationship. I know no, what no, we're no. doing. There's, a, there's space for another seven. Is there? Mm. For another seven? I could have nine wives. You, c you could have nine. Mm. But can you keep one woman happy? Of course. Yeah? I could keep nine happy. Do you reckon? 100%. There's a lot of women to manage, you know? A lot of money to make. Exactly. There's a lot of money to make out here. Yeah. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I'm trying to make a lot of money. Exactly. But do you think you could cater to my needs emotionally? But not nine. I think two is the most. Two? is always going to be better than one, isn't it? Why are you going to want two pum pum instead of one? Especially if they're both tight. Fucking hell, mate. Do you think you could cater to me emotionally? Because yeah. I need a lot of reassurance. Yeah, yeah, obviously. I'll be funny all the time. I stalk you, innit? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get what I'm saying? You're knowing there's a stalker. You're knowing there's a stalker. You get what I'm saying? 
You know, there's a stalker there. You get what I'm saying? Funny, but that's yeah, you know there's a stalker obsessed there. with me. You know there's obsession. I want it. Do you get what I'm saying? I want it until it's psycho level. Listen, you don't, bro. That's the thing. You think. That's why I said I want it until don't. it's psycho. You don't. That's what I'm saying. You don't. I love the idea of my man being obsessed. But it's when they start getting a bit psycho and stalkerish, got to lock them off. Do you reckon you're psycho? There's perfect levels. Yeah. <laughs> there's perfect levels. You give me there's definitely perfect it's levels. Honest. Even the production team can tell there's perfect levels. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? They can see yeah. the other guests and they can see the perfect level <laughs> is. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And that? Yeah, I could be. I don't know if it's psychopath or sociopath, but there's something both. Path, something path. <laughs> You get me? Something path. Oh, you're funny. Ah, I'm not funny. But that's the, that's the start, isn't it? I know, but that's why funny's it's dangerous. The start. Funny's the start. Because yeah. you keep girl of being funny, you know? Shout out my nose. You can get girl of being funny still. I no, think no. I need more wine. Oh, I love a funny guy. Do you? I love funny. Do you? <laughs> why for them? <laughs> no, but I know. I'm kind of... No. What is your thoughts on women in the adult industry? Slags. Slags? Yeah. Have you ever subscribed to someone on OnlyFans? No. No? Hell no. He's definitely subscribed to someone's OnlyFans. But you watch porn. So? That's for free. I could get that on my phone now. Yeah, but that's what free. I'm saying. But like, they're women, they're sex workers. So? They're slags. They're slags. Yeah. But I feel like, what if they, they like the job or they're just troubled? That's up to them. Just slags. Yeah, yeah slags. Slags. Sl Slags. Women. Women are not slags. Stop it. Don't talk about women like that. Slags. Women. Women slags. Women. Okay, cool. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> What's a controversial opinion that you stand on? I don't agree with Batman thing, innit? That's controversial, isn't it? Oh, is it? Yeah. Batman thing's mad. What about if, a, if I was gay? If I was bi as a woman? That's fine because obviously that means I can have two girls. Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah. See, so the men only accept like people being gay when it's for their needs and their pleasure. Okay, so what? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so what? That's it. Are you not ever scared that like the way the world's moving that you're going to be cancelled? I've already been cancelled. Have you? Yeah, I've been cancelled a long time. Well, wow, what have you done to be cancelled? Got stabbed up. I know it's a bit weird, but yeah, I got stabbed up and got cancelled, yeah. No, no, no. Did he just say he was stabbed? Why did you get stabbed? I don't know. Was you just like... He just stabbed me, in it? Fucking... Really? Yeah. So is that from your past and where you went... GRM yourself? Awards. GRM Awards. Oh, is it? Grand Daily Awards, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. How long ago was that? 2018. Really? Yeah, 13 stabs. Bare stabs. Bare stabs. Bare stabs. Oh, yeah, oh my I forgot. I forgot. You go to gym though. I forgot about the wire. Yeah, okay, mate. Yeah, go best stuff. Huh? Go gym, I haven't mate. been gym for a bit. Right. I haven't been gym for a bit. Can I ask, what did it feel like to be stabbed? Like, it sounds really silly. I don't know. But in that present moment, is it like, is it real? Like, with the adrenaline, like you don't actually physically feel it. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how it feels to feel stabbed. You don't know. No. Was it just gone? I think everyone saw the video. There's a video. Yeah. Me sitting in my claret and all that. Oh my yeah. God. How do you deal with that? Like seeing that online or do you just not think about it? Yeah, I don't care. You don't care? Yeah, obviously it's a bit mad that my son's seen it, but yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's crazy. Mm. Oh, I'm glad you're here. Lived yeah, I'm glad I'm here. You know what I mean? Isn't it? Yeah, yeah, come on. Can't be broken. Yeah, come on. Can't be defeated. Mm. Um, what would you say makes you a man? Looking after your kids. I think that makes a man. I feel like there's a lot of men that have kids and they just don't raise them or they just like leave them. Compared but some girls man. trap men though. No. Yeah. yeah. No, I agree. Yeah, that's mad. I wouldn't look after that kid. What? No, you just fully really said what makes no, a man. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, that's what I'm saying. If you look after your kids that you want. So. No, you have to look after all your kids. Okay. What would you say is your love language? Sex. Se oh my God. I swear to God, I feel like all men are wired the same. So oh. sex is your love language. Like touch. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Good at it? Allegedly. Allegedly. Mm. <laughs> um, would you split a bill? No. No? You pay for the bill? No, I let her pay. Really? I'm joking, I'm joking, I'll pay. <laughs> no, I'm joking. How are you doing? What? No, I'm joking. <laughs> 
<laughs> we split that bill. Fuck that, you pay. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I'll pay still. Oh, thank God, because I like men that pay for dates. Do you go on many dates? I don't, no. Do you not? No, I don't. Oh, well, thank you for coming on a date with me. Thank you for um, asking me to come on a date with you. Yeah, it's been nice. I don't know, though. Don't know. Yeah, it is. <laughs> you don't mean... Um, what do you bring to the table? I bring the table. Yeah? You're the table, yeah? Bring the table. Bring the table. Yeah. Yeah? Well, what do you bring? Tell me what you bring him. The table. Yeah, but I want to know. I'll bring the table so we can fuck on the table. Well, of course. Not on this table. Mm. Do you think about sex a lot? Yeah. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I, I, you yeah. actually do. I do. I do. <laughs> is that a bad thing? No, do you know what is? No, this to me, yeah? When I'm in a relationship, my sex drive is at a, a high level. So I need my girl to have a high level of a sex drive. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so you can yeah. fuck so like rabbits. Can... Yeah, yeah. Would you say you're a romantic person? Well, I did bring you the plant. I know. Yeah. I tried. No, you did. I tried. The wickedest thing, I was actually supposed to get proper um, flowers today. Yeah? Supposed yeah. to? Yeah, because, yeah. That's all right, though. It's the fault that counts, mm. even though I can't actually take it home. Mad too. Doing it. Can't you just put it? They didn't see me take it. I teethed it still. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I, I teethed it still, did it? Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, great. If you, put it under, yeah, if you put it under your jacket, you're good. <laughs> great. Yeah, then yeah. I can put it home and just every time I look at it, think of you. Eat it, too. But go on. What would you say are your turn-ons? Cat popcorn. Of course. Hmm. And if it's not, have you ever... I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. You're out? Yeah, if it's not, You're going to finish out. the deed, though. Hmm? You'd finish the deed, you wouldn't just... I won't... What, if I'm in there yeah, and, I mean, literally. and it's baggy? Yeah, but I won't come. Really? No. Why? Because it's baggy. But I feel like, doesn't it all just feel like wet and warm? If it's baggy, it's baggy. If I don't get like, what's the difference? Baggy, in it? They're tight and it's baggy, like, in it? But I'm saying, but with your... <laughs> what do you mean, what's the difference? It's tight and it's yeah, baggy, in it? I feel like... Now, just go like that with your finger. And grip it tight, yeah, and see there's a difference if you don't grip it tight and you do it go like that. There's a difference, isn't it? You don't feel nothing like that, do you? There's your difference. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Said that with a lot of chest. No, but there's a difference, isn't it? What would you say is your toxic trait? Toxic trait? Um, what is a toxic trait? Just something, like, negative about you that's quite, like toxic towards someone else or something that you do that's like my toxic trait i'm obsessive oh is it yeah I, you oh, can't right. have any male friends what do you mean i like my male friends so what's your thoughts on if we're in a relationship and um liking other people's pictures other guys liking other guys yeah, you're liking other girls yeah that's fine we're in the content game yeah if you like other guys that's fine love if they like their pics that's fine i'll shoot them Okay, so we're not I'm like no one's stuff. I'm joking. I'm not, I, I don't do that no more. Yeah, no more. Never. Change, man. Never. Never done it. Ever. Exactly. You're Never been nicked for it. Exactly. <laughs> Never been nicked for it. Never. Ever. Yeah, I think you've got a halo. Yeah. I'm a good guy, really. Since you've been a good guy. I am a good guy, really. I've changed. <laughs> exactly. I swear to God, I was on mind games. If she fucking likes one of them guys' picks, they're dead. How, what do you do to get a woman's attention? Clearly, I've lost yours. No, no, have you got, um... <laughs> Sorry, I've got to pause something. Oh, is that got, what we're doing? Have you got a hotspot? Have you got a hotspot? No, I don't have it on me right now. You because got I didn't bring my phone to a date. You don't bring your phone to a date? No, like, I didn't bring it to our date. So, you have, have you seriously, have you got a hotspot? No. Oh, fuck you. Well, what are you trying to do? No, I need to post something. A trailer. Yeah, fucking hell, man. The podcast, I post about fucking 10 trailers an episode. Needed to post a trailer, didn't I? Don't you like guys that are on, they, I need to do things, no, innit? I'm, I'm not, do you know what I mean? I need to, like, I'm, you know, a bit late. Yeah, I was you late. Came late. I was do you know late. What I, mean? I didn't expect to still be here. Like, <laughs> do you know what I mean? I've got to post, I think. Yeah, well, thanks for staying. <laughs> yeah, come on, man. So what do you do to impress a woman? Um, I've, I've then bringing plants. I know, I went mad. 
I actually want to give you the proper flowers still. Oh, it's nice. It's not nice, baby. Just saying what it's called. <laughs> what do I do to impress a woman? I don't know. I don't try and impress women. No? Not really. Just believe in your source. Not really. What's the impress? I don't know. What do you do to try and impress a man? For me, if I was trying to impress a man, mm. I guess I would want to hang around with him. Just probably go into my feminine. It's just kind of like go around there, try and cook. I'm not the best cook, I can't even lie. Mm. Um, but just try and learn him, if that makes sense. So mm. it's kind of be like, find out what your favourite food is, cook mm. that. I'm good at arm tickles. Arm tickles? Yeah, What's that? that's right. What's that? Like, do you really like, have you never laid down with someone and like stroked them? No. Dick stroke? No, like arm stroke, like stroke them or like. Shock me, shock. Yeah, like, yeah, but you've got a thingy on, so you can't like. Shock, shock. Shock more. Yeah, like, see what I mean? Shock you up there. You flexing your Shock up there. I don't go mad, I don't go <laughs> mad. I don't go mad, the strokes. You turned me on a bit, you know, <laughs> stroking me and that. Gonna be dreaming about that tonight. So, what is a red flag for you? Smelly pump for minute, obviously. Just for a minute as well. But anything else, like you what? You said you had BV, though. No, I didn't say I have it. I've no, said, you said you had women BV. experience it. Yeah, you've had yeah. it before. Yeah, women experience it. Mad. Yeah, but I feel like it's. So you can just natural. wake up with your smelly pump pump? No. Do you know what, actually? Mad. If usually sometimes your pH as a woman gets unbalanced by yeah, men's semen. Yeah, because you're too much different No, men. it's not. It's male's semen. Like a man coming in a woman. If they're fucking out. If it's two it's... compatible people and you always fuck each other, no, it's so... not going to bong. No, but sometimes... It's not going to bong, babe. your diet. It's not going to bong. It's only going to bong if you're going mad. One of you yeah. are going mad. Yeah, what? yeah, but that's how you know. That's how a lot of women... Do you get what I'm saying? No, if one of you are going mad. But that's how women, a lot of them, find out if their man's cheating. Because out of nowhere, you'll be with your partner for years, mm. and out of nowhere, you can get BV. Because you Because a man's using the wrong salt. in another pond. Mm, and you might be using the wrong salt. Yeah. Oh, exactly. So you do know. But I know, Thank but you. my whole thing is this, yeah? And I want women to understand this. If you've got BV, don't be fucking next... Why are you fucking man for? No going to have sex when they've got BV. Bare people have sex when they... Because they put... Do you know how much men have sex with some stinking pom-pom? So obviously you're having sex with BV, but I'm saying if you've got BV, don't open your legs, innit? Yeah. I feel my man's just choosing to go with smelly women at this point. That pattern up your thing. Pattern up your thing. No, but you get what I'm saying? Before you open up your legs again. Yeah. That's fine, but pattern up your thing. Obviously, relationship, it's a bit different, innit? We've got to, we both <laughs> got to just... Madness. We're going mad. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? We're both going to go mad for a sec. But, <laughs> no, but you get what I'm saying? I'm going to hold my nose, but... You, you've got to hold your nose. No sucking funny. But that's why man don't even do you get what I'm saying? Sucking pom pom's mad, because man you go to do that, it's mad. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? And them guys that are actually still doing it, it's mad. They love it down there. Mm? They love it down there. No, but I'm, even when it's stinking, that's crazy. <laughs> do you get what I'm saying? That's mad. Um, do you have any fetishes? Would you like a proper another glass? I'm slow. Well, cheers. Yeah, I'm going mad, innit? Yeah, cheers. I'm going mad, so <laughs> I'm going mad. Have I got fetishes? Um, no. No? French knickers. French knickers, yeah, they're nice. Mm, shit. Nothing wild. What's your freakiest confession? Freakiest? Why for freakiest? Yeah, what is it? Why for freakiest? Why? Why not? What's Why like the freakiest, freakiest thing you've done? Wife a freak. Why not? Freak is even a wife. Why? Because what's a freak? Is a wife. Well, I don't know. You get to do it. Freak is me. a butty boy. What are you talking about? What do you mean? What's a freak? I don't know. You could do something wild. Like you could have wild role play, whatever it is. We can do whatever we want. That was it. No, but I'm saying, like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying, I don't know. <laughs> freak is mad. Like freak is the mad word. Right, I will not say freak. Freak is the mad word. You get what I'm what saying? Is the most freak is terrible. like freak is like transsexual and that. They're no, freaks. No, but I'm saying they're freaks. To me, that's the word freaky. Is I've got a thing with it. <laughs> I'm far from freaky. Yeah. Because I'm not a freak. I like it. Do you get what I'm saying? saying? Freak is like you're freak. You're a freak. 
But you grew up in a different generation. I feel like everything's liberal now. Easy. <laughs> yeah. I haven't told you my age. Easy. I thought I was there looking young. You know, you do Older. look young. I What's think... going on here? <laughs> snap out of that. Snap out of that. No, Shan. but I mean, as, I, no, because I'm in the same category as you. That. We were the same age yesterday. Yes, we are. No, yesterday. Said... <laughs> yesterday. We were the same age. I weren't your uncle yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> We was the same age. Oh. Yeah, you're getting mad. No, we're. I know. Yeah, I think anyone that's thirty. Generation. I'm young, spray. So now what? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you are mm. young, spray. Mm. But I'm saying, as in, like the generation after us, as in, like the TikTok gen. Mm. So that's what I mean, as in, like I feel like we're like it's IG. Like your mother. Mm. Yeah, no, we're IG. Like I call us like our gen, and then there's the TikTok. I'm not gen. IG. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking MySpace, mate. Yeah, yeah. I've been out here for yeah, years. Yeah, exactly. I've been out here for years on MySpace, gen. mate. Yeah. I'm fucking. Do you know what I mean? Fucky Facebook. Fa exactly. We're that gen. So what I'm saying is, in general, in society, it's more liberated. So it's kind of like, I hear what you're saying when you're saying, like, I understand where you're coming from when you're saying it's, like, freaky in that way, like, how you associate it. But it's so different now. Who doesn't like a freak? I'm just not into the freaky shit. Love or money? Uh, money. Money? 100%, really? 100%. Oh, I thought you was going to choose love and then the fuck roll up into the sunset. No, nah, man, I'm not choosing love. Been there before, been there, done that. Heartbreak. It's just fuck. Yeah. Fuck love, you get what I'm saying? Money makes the world go around, innit? It does. Do you know what I mean? Like, it does. what's love got to do with it? That's what Tina Turner Isn't said. It? All right, Tina. Do you know what I mean? You can I love each other. Time. I love love, but it's not doing nothing without no money. That's true. Do you know what I mean? What are you going to do? Love each other in a fucking you know, bed sit? The fuck? Sometimes it gets like that. Have you not got nipples? Sorry. Have I not? I have nipples. Oh, okay. Listen, you can't see my nipples, mate. Have you got nipples? Yeah, yeah you saw them. Yeah. I took my top off. I did. Yeah. I put one nipple. There's nipples yeah. you saw. Um, <laughs> Thank you for the. But I'm, yeah, go on, I'm going. <laughs> I'm um, Have you ever had a one night stand before? Unfortunately. Have you? Unfortunately. Unfortunately. How many have you had, or just one? Not a lot. He's definitely had a lot of one night stands. Not a lot. Mm. But I used to do a lot of drugs, innit? I was to just one night stands. I used to do a lot of drugs. I used to sniff, I used to do um, ease. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And when you're under the influence, like, and you're in a rave or whatever, do you know what I mean? You could in end the up. moment. Yeah, yeah. I hear it. So at the start of the day, yes. we wrote down some assumptions about each other. So my assumption about you was that you're definitely a madman. Mm. You have friendly eyes, but you look crazy. <laughs> friendly eyes. But you look That's the first time I've heard that. Yeah, you have friendly eyes. Seriously, I've heard my eyes are mental. I don't know about friendly eyes because they've been getting my eyes out of there. So I think maybe I've got more crazy frog eyes than friendly eyes. No, yeah, but I did say they look crazy. I said, I said, yeah, no, but crazy. mental, no, but I've never heard them to be friendly. Like big. Big, mad. Big. Crazy frog. And ghetto. Mm, cool song, ghetto. Ghetto to the core. No, he's definitely ghetto, but I love it. <laughs> what do you want me to tell you? My assumptions? Yeah. Oh, mental, all mixed race girls are crazy. Mental? I am, but I'm not. It's like, I, I sound mental saying this. Oh my God, I don't want to prove him right. Sniffs on the low, yeah, takes you up the arse. Never mind. Well, that's some, some tight pump on off. <laughs> no, I do not sniff. I do not take it up the arse. And Never I'm... before. No. I'm not, that's not my thing. No. I'm just putting it out there. But I just thought, well, you know, just moving like you take it up the arse. What do you mean I'm moving like I take up the arse? I don't know. Like, because you took all these freaky stuff and all that. Oh, is it? Like, what are you on about? No. Do you know what I mean? That's what freaks doing it, take up the ass. Can I just say, I have not and never will take it from behind. She definitely takes it up the ass. I don't give you up the ass, but she takes you up the ass. <laughs> no, I can't be freaky though. No, but that's what that's what freaks do. Yeah. To take it up the ass. Well, I don't do that though. <laughs> and yeah, I'm definitely a bit mental. Come on, man. Yeah. <laughs> I've got well, mixed race brother and sister in it. Thank you for coming today. I had a very interesting time. I think you're a lot, you're a lot nicer than what I expected. Do you know what it is? I just, I don't know, man. I think what? it's you. It's me? Yeah, because the last girl, I don't know, man. 
that me show girl was getting a bit more mad because I thought I was coming to meet you in it. So yeah, I was a bit more. Like, no, I think you're really upset. calm. That's what I'm saying. I'm not even happy that I was this calm. Why? It's tame. Oh man, the wire yeah. minister. Isn't it? Yeah, but I like it. I know. No, but I feel like because there is because obviously I see your things up online and I think it's nice because I think you're very real. Mm. Yeah. I'm just gonna think like, why is he so? Yeah. Smitten with Shia, do you know what I mean? Not? Like different people bring out different energies in people. If it makes sense. Mm. And like I've seen you online, mm. and I think the way that you are. It's because it's the first time I'm meeting. Yeah. That's what it is. So I'm a bit. Do you know what I yeah. mean? Like you look good in real life. Do you know what I mean? Thank you. Like some people they're catfishes. Well, thank so you. I didn't know what to expect. What to expect? Type of thing, but you're good in real life. You know, like, I don't know. You. I'm not making your nipples hard, but I'm last right women before. I made her nipples hard. You know, proper <laughs> hard. Like that's what I'm saying. I knew I was yeah? doing something good. Is I it? can't tell you. But, is it? Yeah. Are you, and my face is here. You've got a nice face. It's all right. You do. You do come correct a little. You got a nice face. Fit man. Crazy, but I know, man. Thank you. I think you've got a very nice face. I think you've got a very nice face. I think you've got a very nice fucking hell. And the one that's dancing. Thank you for coming. I'm full. I'm not full. <laughs> this ain't good enough. It's not good enough. Right, so, how did my date go with Young Spray? It was a bit wild, I can't lie. If I had one word to define it, I'd probably say mad. Do I feel I came correct? Well, listen, came on time, got me plant. I came correct, mate, and hopefully tonight I'll come again. Sometimes he came correct, but he spoke about coming so much that he did not come correct in that sense. Cheyenne didn't come correct though, fuck you know. See, the time she came in, I was sitting there for about 10 minutes. I don't even know what he rates the day. I'd probably say he's gonna rate it probably a 8.5. I'm gonna give her, uh, let me give her a nine and a half. Fuck it, you get me, fuck it. Cause I know she's gonna see this in it, so. I've got a mind game, see? Overall, he did make me laugh. He did actually get me a plant. I think she's going to probably rate me about, I reckon, maybe about a six, because they like to style the thing, you get me? But in real life, obviously, you don't see where it was, you get me? I feel like I needed to get to know him a bit more but in order for me to score him properly. So for that, I'm going to give him a 5.5. Would I go on a second date with her? Listen, I'll go on a second, third, fourth, fifth, hundredth, as long as the pum-pum's tight. 